Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah This is a quick um, quick new quick phone call uh, quick update Left a man for the Gambian Kole Wolom Nintuko Gambian Kole without running Wherever you are in this world Nimina Gambian Upon arrival at the international airport If you have love for the country Please Kana Korojo Banyan International Airport so we are urging every patriotic Gambian, wherever you are in this world, if you are coming to Gambia or you're going out of the Gambia, please don't pay the $20 at the international airport, please. Don't pay it until and unless the contract went before the members of the parliament. We are calling on all patriotic Gambians. Momo Mubang who didn't do it. Never at the international airport. Bull for twenty dollars. So for the new Dhaba book at Dugabi. Ninglanyan bull and five bull for the twenty dollars at the international airport because it is illegal. So for the new Dhaba book at Rome. So for the new Dhaba respect the law. Bull for five. Gambian call on Kadia Matole. Move to near Dhaba landing. Momo Yalonko, il est à Gambiela. Momo Yalonko, il est à Gambiela, Lua Bunya. Bédan Alay Wolom Nindiko. Kana Kodojo, Banyun International Airport, ni pour la guerre. Il y a Kodojo, Banyun International Airport, from today. Alonko, il y a Kodojo, Kanle, pour que Bankola, Lua Tinya, you are bribing. Momo Yalonko, il y a Kodojo, Banyun International Airport, from today. Alonko, il y a Mari, il y a Moja, il y a Support Kang. Il y a un de support qui est en train de se faire. Il y a un banque qui est en train de se faire. Il y a un banque qui est en train de se faire. Il y a un banque qui est en train de se faire. Il y a un banque qui est en train de se faire. Il y a un banque qui est en train de se faire. Il y a un banque qui est en train de se faire. Il y a un banque qui est en train de se faire. Niatara de iman laku gambia banko akatama ni luala isaji unole. Mbe gambia nko beda na nyina. Momo ya lanko imu gambia dinkendori. Ngali yako, kuna banko na samba ni luala. I think this is one of the simple way. Nyina mudi opportunity ti na na banko muta. Na mekso ko momo ya lanko ima lua noma. Na mekso ima ya lua tamandi. Nyina mu one of the best example for us. So we are saying Jarama, thank you very much. Uh, Sik Martin, what do you have done? You know, bank could not carry it. The immigration have no power to hold your passport because you are a Gambian. The immigration have no power to hold your passport. All what they have to do is they have to confirm whether your visa is uh, your visa is a valid visa or not. As far as you have the visa, you have right to travel anywhere in this world. Because the cost you are paying at the international airport, this is a cost, Mayor Alonko. You have already paid it when you are booking your flight. So we are now calling on every petrol Gambian, as far as you are a Gambian, and you want our country to be governed by law. We are appealing to you. We are appealing to the every. We are appealing to anybody, Mayor Alonko. You are a Gambian, even if you are not a Gambian. If you believe in the rule of law, we are calling you upon arrival at in Banyun International Airport, don't pay. Wallahi Azim. If everybody stand and say we are not going to pay because it is illegal, this contract have not uh, has have not been tabled before the members of the parliament in the Gambia, Wallahi, they will stop it. The only way to stop it is we have to rebel against them. They are economic junglers, they are people who have not respect the law of this land. And we have to hold them accountable because we are the people who voted for them into, to be at the office. Either I vote for him or not, as far as he is terming himself as the president of the Republic of the Gambia, what he is doing is not according to the law of this land. Please, 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 for the sake of Allah, we are appealing to everybody. Wallahi, if we have, let's say, 100 Gambians who are traveling to the Gambia, for example, or we have 50 Gambians, and all said that we are not going to pay it, Summa Wallah al Azim, is going to be stopped. It's going to be stopped because they cannot keep you in the airport without giving you food. They cannot keep you in the airport without giving you, without providing the necessary needs for you. That will be loss of revenue for them. 
So we are appealing, Wallah, we are appealing. For the sake of Allah, for the sake of the love of the country, for the sake of the love, the love for rule of law, we are calling on all patriotic Gambians, don't pay, Wallah, I'm appealing to you, don't pay any dam upon arrival at International Airport. The money they are collecting from us is fraud. And it has been clear to you that it's fraud. The moment you pay a dam on the international airport means you are part of the people who are robbing this nation. And Allah the Almighty is going to ask you, the day of Kiamat, where have you put your money? A money you have worked for, you know how you struggle to get money in the Europe. You know how you struggle to get money wherever you are in this country. Let us not give them chance to be robbing us. Please. Please, for God's sake. For God's sake. For God's sake. We are appealing to you. Ngaldan Alayro. Nglenyan. So if you can hear Domi Romila. Dangabuga Romi. Nglenyan, please. So I can see, so I can see, uh, see airport, the bullfire, Alice Fovunonu. Because Alice go and the young coy fire Fovunonu, Alice Bovunonu, do Alice, do Alice go and the warring of fight. And do Aklua Gambia. Because Gambia, Lua Gambia, Mune, contract go and the young coy to work, contract with the power of them through tender. Now I've been the air, now I've been the air, now I've been the air. If they stop you not to come out of the airport, just stay there. Just stay there. Because that will not, that will not favor them because there are other people come. They don't have the capacity to keep you, to keep 100, 200 people in the airport. We have to come as family. We have to love our country. We have to make sure our country is governed by laws. That's the only way. That is the only way. This is completely heartbroken. Our president lead by people, lead, lead by, lead people to rob us. Daylight robbery. Because this is daylight robbery. Daylight robbery. A contract which was not tendered before the members of the parliament. And that contract is costing Gambia a lot of money. Billions of dollars is every, every month. Please, this is not about politics. This is about this is about law for the law for your country. Thank you very much.